Okay, we are back again in this other video under um, principles of moment, and we are going to use one of the principles of moment to answer this question. If you have forgotten about this, please go and revise. If you wish to continue lessons with me, you can contact me. I'm available for both GCE and G12. Let's dig in. The diagram below shows a 100 centimeter meter room. It's pivoted at 45. So the pivot, this part here, is at 45 centimeters. We are analyzing now together, all right, so that we can answer this question properly. The question says, find X. Now, for us to find X, it's just like the weight of this box, which we don't know, or this shape, whatever it is. To do that, please, to do that, let's call this box as box 1. We call it B1. And let me call this as B2. Now, because I don't know, I'll, I'll call it BX because of X there. I hope we're following each other. Now, let me put the data here for B1. Let's put the data for B1. What data does B1 have? What is the force? So I'll say F1 is 50 newtons. You'll put it there. What is the distance? Now, this distance we're talking of is the distance from where it is there to the pivot there. Now, the pivot is at 45 and it's from 0 to where the box is. They're saying it's 10 centimeters. I hope you are, you, you are seeing. So since it's 10 here, if I subtract 10 minus 45, so 45 minus 10, which is 35, is the distance of the box from the pivot. In short, it is this distance. It's that distance there. That is the 35 centimeters for each other. Again, the box for this one, let me call it BX. The force, okay, the force 2 is just X. And the D2, which is distance 2, is the distance from where it is there, okay, all the way from there, to the pivot. To the pivot, now they are saying from 100 to here is what? It's, two, it's 20. The distance between that one is 20. The question is, at which, at which distance is, it, it, what's the distance from there to there? Okay, so just say, okay, 45, all right, 45 minus 20, what do you get? You're probably going to get uh, 25, right? So if you see it's 25, that is from 45, and and and, and what? And uh, mm, the difference between 45 and 20, you get 45, you, you get 25 there. Such that 25, okay, so, so, such that 40, from here, to if this is 45 from 100, we are remaining to what? Uh, 55. So 55, eventually we are going to get it out of there. So we must be able to add, if this is 10, 30. Okay, so 45 should be able to get 100. Plus, so this is, so from here, okay, let, let me just run you through again. So from here, this is it. That, that means this box, 100. Okay, let me just do this. So what is 100 minus 20 is 80, right? So this is where the 8, so the box is at 80 centimeters. So now we are saying 80 minus 45, what do we get? You can just subtract 80, okay, minus 45. It's giving me 35 as well. So you put 35 here. Like that. I hope you, you, you've seen what I've done here. This is 100, okay? It's not zero, like, like, like this side, no. This is 100. So what is 100 minus, minus 20 is 80. So the box is put at 80. Okay, maybe let me just change the distance. Let me put 30 here so that we can have something nice. So that we can have something nice. Okay, so if the box is, is a, the, if the distance between the box and the, and the last part of the meter is 30, what is 100 minus 30? 70 centimeters. That's what the box has been put. Now, if the box has been put at 70 centimeters, what are we going to do? We are going to say 70 minus uh, 35, sorry, 45, to give me 25. 
centimeters. I hope what we did this side is that it's from zero to ten. So eventually it will just be forty five minus ten. It's the same thing, right? But this side because of hundred, it will first subtract thirty from hundred seventy. Seventy again from forty five. Give that. Then we use the principle of moment. F one multiplied by D one is equal to F two multiplied by what? D two. They should be able to balance up because this is in your in equilibrium. Okay, F1, F1 is 50, D1 is 35. There's no need of changing centimeters to meters. There is an equation which is equal, so there's no need for that. F2 is X multiplied by, mm -hmm. let me change, F2 is X multiplied by D2 is 25 centimeters. What do we do? Of course, from here it will be over 25 centimeters, and here it's over. 25 centimeters and what you get as your x so you have 50 multiplied by 35 then we divide by 25 give me 70 newtons okay that's the force it's about of x can you fail i doubt